Good Friday morning, Pastor Ken. Happy Valentine's weekend to you. I pray that you will have a good time with the one you love today. And I pray for you if maybe that love thing's not happening right now. I know Valentine's Day is a really good time for a lot of folks celebrating, having fun. But I also know and understand that there many of us is just... You know, Pastor Ken, this love thing, this relationship thing is not happening for me right now. So I pray the love of God will fill your heart. I pray the love of God will grant you peace. And I pray in the days coming, the weeks and months ahead, that God will bring to you, restore to you, the love of your heart and the desires of your heart and your life. Draw near to God. He'll draw near to you. He has a promise and a plan and a purpose for you. And I want to see it fulfilled in your life. That's my prayer. I love 1 Corinthians 13, verse 13 where it says, now there abides three things that last forever, faith, hope, and love. And the greatest of these is love. So I pray today that you will know the love of God, the greatest love in all the universe. I pray you would know God's love today, the love of Jesus Christ on the cross of Calvary, the love, the fruit of the Holy Spirit evident in your life that your life may begin to rise, your future going forward to be bright, full of faith, full of hope, and full of love. That's God's promise for you. Those things have been promised to you through the power of the Holy Spirit and God's love for you. Faith, hope, and love. I pray they'll be your portion today. Amen. If we can serve you anyway at Harvest Church, we're always here for you. You can check us out online, find us on our website service on this coming Sunday. And, I, and again, I pray, uh, may the Lord bless you with those friends and the love relationships you've been longing for. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you.